How to add testers to your app on the Google Play Console for close testing. As you may know, a minimum of 20 testers is now required for new individual developers to publish an app and unlock the production function. Firstly, we open the Google Play Console dashboard. On the homepage, we can see two apps. We need to check the status of the app, which should be in closed testing. It should not be in review or draft, but in closed testing. Now we need to click on View App for the app to which we want to add testers. Now as you can see, we are on the dashboard of the app where we will add testers as required by Google. After scrolling down, you can see that the first step is marked as complete since our app has been reviewed and passed. Now for the second step, we need to add 20 testers for testing. As you can see, it currently shows zero testers in the bracket, so let's move to adding testers in closed testing. On the left side of your screen, under All App, you'll find a box labeled Releases and Testing. Here, you should find Closed Testing. If you don't see Closed Testing, click on Testing and a drop-down menu will appear where Closed Testing should be listed. For now, we need to click on Closed Testing. After clicking on Closed Testing, we can see the closed testing of our app. As you can see, there are active tracks and closed testing alpha. Here, you can see a mark of approval for the version we have released. On the right side, you see Manage Tracks, so you need to click on Manage Tracks. Now you can see closed testing alpha. Here we are, we see three tabs, Release, Countries, and Testers. As we need to add testers, so we will click on the Testers tab. Let's click on the Testers tab. After clicking on the Testers tab, you will see two radio buttons. The first one is for email lists, and the second one is for Google Groups. For now, we need to select the radio button for Google Groups. Now that we have selected the Google Group, we need to enter the Google Group's email ID. As you can see, our Google Group's email ID is teamnx at googlegroups.com. After typing the email ID, press Enter, then it will show a circle as you can see in the picture. As we have selected the Google Groups and entered the email ID, we need to save it. As you can see on the right-hand side at the bottom of the screen, there is a Save button. Click on the Save button. Now after some time, there is Join on Android or Join on Web. We have two links, so for now, we need to click on Join on Android. You can see Copy Link in blue text. We need to click on the Copy Link button. As we click on the Copy Link button, it will copy the app links from where we can download it. Keep in mind that only those who are testers can see this or download the applications. Otherwise, it will show no application found. We are in the final stage. After copying the app link, you will have to send it through WhatsApp or Gmail. As demonstrated in this video, you will compose a message, paste the link into the message box, and send it to apptestersforme at gmail.com. This service is provided by us. You can also contact us on our WhatsApp number, country code is plus 91, and phone number is 7050030072. Our email ID is apptestersforme at the rate gmail.com. We will provide 20 testers for your app. We have a team of 35 people who will test your app on real devices. The charges for the app testing service are $100 USD. We will ensure that you meet the requirement of 20 testers. Thank you. If you have any questions, you can ask us.